There are no referees, no goalies, no slap shots, and no checking. Instead, it's four-on-four -four hockey played the way kids do it in Minnesota and elsewhere growing up. For many of us, it's the way we learn how to play on our backyard rinks, on creeks, on lakes. There's no icing. It's just, like we say, uh, pure, beautiful hockey. Instead of a net, players aim at a wooden box. To score, the player has to put the puck into one of two small slots on the box. There's no Zamboni. Instead, players clear the ice with a shovel before the game begins. You definitely are dealing with the elements with pond hockey, whether you're dealing with uh, mixed precipitation that makes bumps on the ice, all the way to cracks that sometimes can be created, uh, all the way to the wind. You know, it's, it's nice to have the wind at your back when you're on offense. This year's tournament is being played at Lake Nokomis in South Minneapolis. That's what kind of pond hockey is all about. It's getting together with your friends, guys that uh, you're done playing hockey, uh, organized hockey, and you get together and you go outside and you play hockey for an hour, hour and a half, get a good sweat in after work, and uh, just get a chance to hang out with the guys. So as an adult, it's a little bit of a return to your childhood, playing, playing the game you love without uh, any of the grown-up rules. 1,600 players are competing in this year's tournament. Several hundred games will be played on 27 rinks that have been set up on the lake. Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.